Hello. All right. So in my classic planner this week, I'm going to use the Plan to Stitch uh, Planning Kit uh, Rose Gold Blush Kit. And I'll kind of flip through it. I've already put in the numbers and that kind of thing. That's a very pretty kit. I like it. It's one that I had a shop credit to her shop and I used. So I've got that. From Charlotte's Minis, we got this meetup sticker. I'll use it because I have my Cleveland um, Creative Cleveland Planner Girls meetup this week. I am not sure who made these. I got them at the last social. From Three Tiny Bows, I have the Chore Girl stickers. And I do PR for her. I have the work stickers also. And the cute little trash cans. And the code for that is TTB Vanessa to save 20%. And from Brianna Nicole Designs, I've got the kitty faces, the traveler's notebooks, Jerry shopping. I've, I'd use a ton of her icons. Jerry payday, Jerry and buy groceries, another grocery one. I never kind of know what I need. So I've got the shave, the busy doing nothing, they get crafty. I did start a new cross stitch. I've got the rainbow colored traveler's notebooks, the coffee, the TVs, the I don't feel very worky the dishes, the buy cat food that i got to remember to do this week. And then for the clips I am using, I have this pretty rose from the Glitter and Glam Squad. This rose from Run With Craft Scissors. Run With Craft Scissors. This from Noni's Creations. This is Planner Nerd. And this one from She Is Crafty Designs. And it is my name. I thought they all went well with the kit. So we will go ahead and get started. So I'll kind of spread these sheets out in front of me so I can see and hopefully won't have to look so much for them. So all these, you know, look like they're made nicely. Very pretty kit. I like it. Very uh, pretty peonies. My second favorite flower, my first one being roses. Those work down nicely. And I think I will do my full boxes next. I'm going to put these little polka, polka dots right up here in the corner. here. Monday is a holiday. It's Memorial Day. So we're going to dinner at my sister's. It is very, very warm. I do like how these all have different patterns. It's a very pretty kit. I like it a lot. And these are similar so I will use them together and kind of I like to keep the weekend ones beside each other and while we got this here we'll go ahead and do the days of the week and as I'm looking now I can see that one is on there very crooked so I'll have to see what I can do about covering that up here in a minute. Or not covering it up so much as just moving it. These little date covers are very cute. 
Got lots of stuff to do this week. I gotta make sure Saturday is the Creative Cleveland Planner Meetup. Very excited for that. For me, it's a couple hour drive. So I need to make sure that I allow myself plenty of time to leave and get there early. So I like to have everything done Friday night. And that way I can just get up Saturday morning and go. Hmm. That was nice. So it peeled up fairly easy. It's always nice. So that way if they go down crooked, you can replace them. So open this up. Alright, so I like this bright this week. So I'll go ahead and get this done. So I'll put this one here. And then I chose one of these pretty ones here for the meal stickers. I don't really track my hydration because I drink coffee all day. And I think I will use important from my trackers. Because they are fairly important to make sure that, you know, I do take my medications and get my steps in. Because I am very limited on a lot of the exercises I can do. So I always try to make sure that I get my steps in. I enjoy walking. So I walk a lot. Alrighty, so we got that. We'll kind of see where we are. Now I'm going to do the check boxes. Like I said, I got a lot of stuff to get ready this week. Back to turning the planner upside down. I don't know why. For me, it just, it's easier for me to line the stickers up upside down. I don't know what the point of it is. It's just easier for me. Check boxes. Put the pretty weekend banner in here. I really like this weekend banner. Very nice and fancy. Very pretty. Oh, I like these pretty little hearts too. I think I'm going to put them on the sides of my banner here. I'm going to use these pretty full boxes to kind of cover up the rest of the borders that, you know, I didn't cover with anything. And I'll use them to put, like, whatever the my TV tracker's in. And I just like to kind of have those kind of things covered up.
And I will use these for my work. And they're just going to kind of bounce around. And I'll only have, you know, five of those. For now, I will put a couple of the little half stickers here. All right, so I think that's what I want to mark for this week. I do like the canceled and rescheduled. I'll put my little reminder things here because this will be the day that I'm packing. So I want to put all my little pack things there. Little coffees are cute. Put them on Monday and Friday. Alright, so I think that is... Oh, Thursday is payday. So I will use this payday sticker. I'm going to put it right down here. As it is payday. And I like this little girl all dressed up like she's got she's got her planner. So I'll use it too. Alright. So Saturday is the planner meetup. Use that one. That is the Creative Cleveland Meetup. I'm very much looking forward to it. So we'll get that. Thursday will be the day that I go to the store. Cause I want to, it's payday, so I want to make sure that I get all that done ahead of time. So I'll pick up cat food for the cat. Saturday, you know, I'll make sure I get all this stuff done before I go. Monday, whoever feels, oh, I don't work on Monday. So Tuesday will be, I don't feel very worky today after a long weekend. And I don't mind if like, there's different colors in the spread. I think that kind of helps it stand out a little more. Since I do have that set aside for that, I'll put my little TV sticker down there. Since Monday is a day off, I have lots of coffee. And I have planner stuff that I want to work on tomorrow. And a couple other crafts. Like I said, I'm starting on my, um, I just started a new cross stitch project. Sunday is usually kind of my relaxed day. And as always, I'll get up and do my, you know, weekly chores. Thursday will be shopping day, so I'll put my little grocery shop sticker there. Since I got to buy cat food. I'll put a little Luna here just because I like the kitties. 
Wednesday, I gotta remember to take out the trash. And then these mark my any time over that I work. I'll have to look because I have day off stickers somewhere, so I'll need to put that on there. No, oh, I won't have enough for next week. <clears throat> and because I have my meetup, I've got to do laundry on Saturday. Mm. And I always vacuum on Wednesday. And Thursday, because I am the meetup has like a potluck. So I am baking cookies, or if I don't bake them, at least buying them when I go to the store, but I gotta have cookies. Oh no, I'll do that Friday. Yes, I'll do that Friday. Want and want day old cookies. But see, even these peel up fairly good. Ooh, so that works. So there, so we wanna do that Friday, so they're ready for Saturday. Woo, almost messed that up. So there, I think I am done for the week. So the red don't quite glow, but I really did like the roses. And I think they're dark enough that it's, it kind of blends in. And since I do have the planner event, I use the planner nerd. So there is my spread for this week. And thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.